Hey, Mike here from Six Pack Philosophy. I'm going to give you my own version of a, of a holiday treat, a holiday drink. Uh, if you just tuned in earlier, you might have seen John and Anna out there talking about their eggnog and, and all this. But, but this is, a, this is a, an important family recipe. We're going to talk a little bit about the right way to drink scotch. Now, uh, it's, it's important to get the right kind of scotch. It depends on what you like. This is famous grouse. It's actually a middling scotch. It's a blended scotch. Uh, it's not a high end. It's not a super low end, but it's what I've drank since I was a, a young Marine. I had a, a first sergeant that got me on this famous grouse, and, and it's got a, a real smooth taste to it. Now, it's important that you get the mix right whenever you're doing, doing something like this, okay? Scotch has got a, a, a really unique woody taste. By the way, to be called Scotch, it's got to be brewed in, brewed in Scotland. Uh, it's got to be aged for three years in a in, in a uh, oak wooden barrel, uh, and it's it's just a high quality drink. Now, what you want to do is a couple of different ways. People will tell you sometimes that you need to put a little bit of ice in there, and you need, you want your Scotch on the rocks. A lot of people like to drink it that way, but I'm telling you, if you put your put, if you put the ice in this drink, what you're actually doing is you're watering your drink down. Now, there is an exception if you make your ice out of distilled water so that water comes up and as it melts, you end up getting those oils coming up from the scotch. That's a good way to do it. But otherwise, you don't, you don't really want to put a lot of ice in there. But you do want to cool it. There's a couple of ways you can do that. What I generally do whenever I'm trying to do this is I'll just put a couple of things of ice in my glass and I'll spin it around. That's all you really have to do with this as far as, I, as making this perfect. You can get fancy and use these mixing things. We're not doing that. The most important part of this is the pour. When you're pouring this, you need to pour with a little bit of strength, a little bit of power, and a pretty full glass. Now your scotch is something that should be enjoyed. A perfect mixed drink is one part scotch, and it's wonderful. <laughs> Merry Christmas to you.